Freedom of Information Act and the dictatorship of mediocrity and corruption. Good. There's an utmost need for us to draw one another's attention to the increase in awareness, usefulness, and strength of the Freedom of Information Act. Using it as a tool to tackle impunity, mm -hmm. mediocrity, mm -hmm. and corruption in the society. Mm -hmm. Freedom of Information Act, aka My Rights This means the right to access information held by public bodies. As a colonial territory and later an independent state, Nigeria inherited from their colonial masters a culture in which secrecy was the default mode of dealing with information. Yeah. Although, the right to the freedom of information is enshrined on, under Section 39 of the 1999 Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, as well as Section 9 of the African Charter on Human and People's Rights, spelled out under Cap A07 Laws of the Federation, 2004. <laughs> like they say, Every nation deserves the kind of leadership it gets. Because eh? Eh? Come again, sir! I mean, eh? I am trying to... Every Okay, okay. If you disagree with me, now tell me, what is Nigeria's greatest problem? continent, 
Nigeria is now the ninth country to have passed the FOIA. Other country being Angola, Ethiopia, Guinea, Liberia, Niger, and South Africa, Uganda, and Zimbabwe. <laughs> Meanwhile, while well, many Nigerians may be celebrating the enactment of the act, it is now clear that the FOIA contains some inherent deficiencies in it. The FOIA contains more exemption sections and courses than sections that grant access to information. A situation which might be exploited by some public officers for mischievous purposes. Uh, but the point is, we have our FOIA, so let us use it well. Accountability does matter. So also, transparency is necessary for accountability. Eventually, the Freedom of Information Act, FOIA, was signed into law on the 28th of May 2011 by President Goodluck E. Jonathan. It is the first law that empowers Nigerians with the right to access records of public institutions as well as private sectors where they perform responsibilities of public nature. The Act, which is a codification of the right to know and also a fundamental human right, grants every Nigerian citizen the legally enforceable right to access public health records. Any refusal to disclose information held by a public body, by a requester, is subject to appeal to the High Court. It is also important to note that nobody is above the provisions of the FOIA. The full culture of record keeping and maintenance, retrieval capacity challenge is in many public institutions, bureaucracy in the public sector, as well as widespread corruption and appalling ignorance among the workforce of the public sector. These constitute challenges to the achievement of the goals of the FOIA. Finally, it is the responsibility of all Nigerians to carry out the oversight function of ensuring compliance to the provision of the act and not that of the government alone. And the entire citizenry must rise up and exercise their right to know as the impact of the act will not rest on the civil society alone. As such, the mass media and the general public must take full advantage of the act. Say no to mediocrity. Say no to corruption. It takes you and I to make that change. Pray for a free, fair, neutral and just state. Give honesty a room. Say, Say yes to intellectual, cultural, social economic and, and political, political developments. developments.